Hey guys, today we will be solving a 3x3. 3x3 is a cube which has 3 layers and you need to know how the cube works if you want to solve the cube. So for 3x3, you have 8 corners and 12 edges. And also, you must remember the 3x3, the center will not move when whatever move you do like this or like this. A 3x3 has red, blue, orange, green, white, and also the yellow. To solve a Rubik's cube or 3x3, you need to know the notation of cube. So, first one, U, U prime. So, when it's a prime, the move is clockwise no anti-clockwise okay then u2 move the u face twice okay for front face f like this f prime is like this so for the r face right face is r R prime and left face the L is like this L prime like this so basically you just need to know the notation for the cube is like this so for this tutorial you have to scramble the cube and then choose one color as your cross we will need to solve a cross First, so this is a yellow cross and white cross or even blue cross it depends on you you can choose any cross color you want okay after you scramble the cube they will look like this so for me I will choose for the white cross the white face so first you will need to move the corresponding edges the white edges to the U face so like this one you move it like this and the last one here you move it into like this and then you find an empty space like this one this empty space you move it to here move up like this so if you get something like this you move it down to here and then you find the empty space move it up then the next step you need to match the colors to the centers and then you move it down like this and this one move it down match the colors move it down and this one match move it down next step we will be solving the corners of the white face so first you and just for the corners like this one, the red and green, you put it on the slot here and then you do the three move L prime, U prime, L. So you soft the corners here. Okay, and the next if you see something like this, you move to the slot for this one red blue here so what you do you do this algorithm r u r prime u prime you do three times this one is first so the second time r u r prime u prime r u r prime u prime then you solve this corner so you do the same thing until you solve the first layer now we will solving the second layer so you you need to search for the edges so at this one I match just the colors first and you need to remember if you this piece and this piece red blue if you go to the right side you move it to the left 
if it moves to the left side, move to the right. So this one you will need to put into the right side here. Yeah? So I move to the left like this, do a U, then I do the algorithm R U R prime U prime. So this algorithm is like this and then you rotate like this. The two pieces is set up like this. So this is the corner and the edge is right here. So you set up like this and then you do L prime U prime L like this. Then you stop this piece. So basically it's look like this. So for this one I move it. I see something like this and then I move it to the left side because it put into this and this face. So I move like this. R U R prime U prime. Then move inside like this. So for this one is move to here. So I move to the right side and then to L prime U prime L U. So this are left rhythm. So set up like this and then do right hand move R U R prime like this. So you repeat the same step until you solve the second layer. So the next step you done the first two layers and then now you get three possible case. First you maybe get a dot or a L shape and a line or even a cross. So first I'll show you the line no the dot side. So the dot shape you do this algorithm F R U R prime U prime F prime so you get an L shape so for the L shape like this you move it to like this and then you do the same algorithm like just now F R U R prime U prime F so you get a line like this so for this one F R U R prime U prime F prime so do like this you get a cross so you must remember when you get a L shape like this you do the F R U R prime U prime F prime twice so you can solve across like this so and this step is orienting the edges and also the corners so for the corners you do this algorithm R U R prime U R U2 R prime so it's really simple and for your information you will need to make it until you get a fish shape and you must remember you must have no yellow stickers facing you so you can rotate like this and then do the algorithm like this okay you will get a fish shape then you rotate it until it looks like this so you have you must have one yellow sticker like this do R U R prime U R U2 R prime so you solve this face but with without any corners or edges or the quarry like this okay so if you get a case this is you have a fish shape but you have no yellow stickers facing you like this what you do you do the same algorithm then you rotate it back you will get one yellow sticker back here so you do the algorithm you solve yellow face like this 
So the last step will be permitting the last layer. So after we've done the yellow face, you will be doing collecting the edges and the corners. So first you need to collect the corners. So you move the adjacent corners like this one. You move it to the left side and you do R prime L prime U2 R U R prime U prime U prime L U prime R so you correct all the corners if let's say you have no adjacent corners like this case you will need to do the algorithm twice like this So you get adjacent corners, move to the left side and do the algorithm again. So you get all the corners permitted quality and then the last step you will be permitting the edges. So you move the soft faces facing you like this. So you do this algorithm R U R prime U prime. And the left side L prime U prime L U. Then you do the reverse like this Q R U prime R prime U prime L prime U L. You solve the Q. If let's say you do the algorithm, but it's not soft, you do one more time like this. So the cube is soft. Thanks for watching this video. If you like this video, click the thumbs up and be sure to subscribe to this channel and comment in the comment section if you have any question. Bye.